close your eyes and watch your breath. Take a couple of good long, deep in and out breaths so you can sense where it's most obvious. And then ask yourself if it's comfortable. If it's not comfortable, you can change. Longer breathing, shorter, faster, slower, heavier, lighter. Try to find what kind of breathing feels best for the body right now. If you find something that feels good, stick with it until it doesn't feel so good anymore, and then you can change. Try to keep on top of what's going on in the body and the mind in the present moment. Because it's right here that we're making our choices in life, and all too often we're off someplace else. We're like the owner of a factory. He gives orders to his workers, then he goes off, goes off on a vacation, and they pretty much do what they want. In other words, there are parts of the mind that are making decisions that you're not really aware of. And sometimes you find out about them only, only later. This is why it so often happens if you ask somebody why they did something, they'll have to stop and think from it. Well, why did I do that? They weren't really there. They are off on vacation. Work is being done all the time, so you want to make sure the work is always being done well. The law of karma operates 24-7, and so your attention, your alertness has to be 24-7 as well. Now, to keep this up requires a sense of well-being. That's why we try to create this sense of well-being through the breath, so we can stay in the present moment feel good in the present moment. It's like staying in your factory but having a really nice executive suite. And you go out and you check out in the different parts of the factory every now and then. But you make sure you have a home base where you can go when, when you get tired. You need some rest. You need some recharging of your batteries. So try to create this sense of well-being, at least one spot in the body. Make sure that that stays consistent. Anything else that may come in to disturb you, just think of it dissolving away, dissolving away. Don't let these patterns of tension build up. And that way you'll be more comfortably in the present moment, more steadily in the present moment. And it's when you're steady here that you can see the little things that happen when you are allowing your attention to be diverted here and there. You're right here all the time. As I say in some of the news stations, all the news, all the time. We don't need all the news, but you need all the news about your own mind, what it's doing, what its decisions it's making. And you have to be here for it to be all the time, otherwise the news gets forgotten, or it doesn't even get noticed. And you end up doing things that you wonder afterwards why you did them. And after all, it is your actions that are creating your world. So do a good job. Stay on the job. But do it with a sense of ease and well-being.